To install Billiard Business Solutions on your system, the first thing you should do is download the file from the link that you received and copy it onto your desktop or to another place where you can easily find it. Here the file has been downloaded to the desktop. Double click the file to open it. You may be asked a question if you want to install this from an unknown publisher, just click yes. Our program will ask you do you want to install Billiard Business Solutions, just click yes. And then it will extract some files. And then you should see a warning about installing MDAC underscore type and AH script setup in Windows Service Pack 2 compatibility mode for Windows XP. Just click OK. At this point, our program will open up one file, a Word file, uh, in rich text format that will explain to you how to set up these two files properly in Windows 7. Uh, you can follow along the demonstration here if you still need to read these instructions you can do so at a later time to, to help you out but for right now we're just going to minimize this file as we watch how to install these two files one of the windows that was opened after you clicked OK after the warning was a an explorer window giving you the location of the two files you need to set up properly a script underscore setup and MDAC underscore TYP. These two files are necessary to install and run Billiard Business Solutions. First of all, click on AH script underscore setup, right click on it, and you should see a menu pop open. Find the menu called Properties. It should be towards the bottom and click on it. Here you'll see a, a series of tabs on top you'll look for the one that says compatibility and make sure that the compatibility mode section ha that has a box that says run this program in compatibility mode for uh, different operating systems is set to Windows XP you can use service pack 3 or service pack 2 it doesn't matter but make sure the box is checked also you should see another box towards the bottom a privilege level section which will ask you if you want to run this program as an administrator. Uh, make sure this box is, is checked also. And then just click OK. You've set up this file so that it can be run now properly on Windows 7. Do the same for NDAC underscore TYP. Right click on it, find the properties menu, look for the compatibility tab, make sure the compatibility mode is set to Windows XP and that box is checked and see that the privilege level is set to administrator run this program as administrator make sure that box is checked and then click OK now after you've done this for both of these files you can now open these files and they should run properly in Windows 7 you may be asked if you want to run this program from an unknown publisher just click yes uh, age script will install a few files and then after the hourglass disappears you're you're done and that should take about half a minute on a recent computer and then do the same with mdac underscore typ this is the data access components that need to be installed for billiard business solutions just right click on it and click on open or double click on it to open it you may see again a message saying do you want to allow this program to make changes just say yes now you'll see the license agreement for Microsoft Data Access Components 2.0. Just agree with it, say yes. It will extract the files it needs for installation. It'll initialize setup and just click on continue. It will then search for installed components on your system to see that they've been installed before or whether or not they are present. Then you should see uh, a couple options. Do you want to do a complete install or a custom install? Just click on the complete install. This will install all data access components. Setup will check for necessary disk space and then it will update your system so that the Microsoft data access components will be installed. And after it's finished, it will give you a message saying that Microsoft Data Access Components 2.0 setup was completed successfully. Click OK. At this point, you've set up these two files properly. 
a script underscore setup and ndac underscore typ. You can now minimize this window and you should see our installer window. Click on the menu called other and you'll see the third menu from the top should say update BBS. Click on that to install Billiard Business Solutions. The Windows installer will proceed to install the files necessary for the running of Billiard Business Solutions. It should install a couple icons on your desktop for a shortcut so you can run the program from there if you have it set that icons are allowed to appear in Windows 7 on your desktop. Otherwise you'll need to, to click on the, the start button to, to find the program. But after that's completed, you, you should see a message saying that Billiard Business Solutions has been uh, completed successfully and that you're, you're good to go. And in just a minute here we should see the icons appear and we should find that uh, we have the The, the section set up for billiard solution, b business solutions in your start menu programs. Here we see that the icons have appeared. We can start billiard business solutions from here. And then when the installer is finished, we should also be able to start billiard business solutions from the, the programs section of your uh, start menu. When it's finished, you'll see, see a message saying that the installation has completed, and just click OK. At this point, you can just close out the application. Uh, right, right now, this time, you can double-click the Billiard Business Solutions from your, your desktop, or just click on it to, to open it, and uh, click on Continue, Continue, Continue and your program should open. If this is the first time you've installed Billiard Business Solutions on your system, you may see a message that the X10 drivers have not been registered or that they have not been installed. Just click OK on in that instance and uh, restart the Billiard Business Solutions program, then you should be fine. It's just that the one of the X10 light control components needs to be registered first, and that happens when the program runs the first time. And after you restart it the second time, you shouldn't have any problems. But if you do have any questions, please call our tech-free, toll-free tech number at 888-428-7665, extension 303. After you have the program installed, just click on the Help menu. Click on Billiard Business Solutions Help. And you should see uh, a quick setup link here. Just click on that. So you can click here and uh, it should walk you through some of the basic things you'll need to know about how to set up the program. Again, if you do have any questions, please call 888-428-7665, extension 303.